with yet another episode on our YouTube channel Rescue by Cario. First of all, a small reminder to subscribe to our YouTube channel if you like our uh, episodes and also um, if you wish to be notified uh, when new episodes come out every week. So, what do we have to here today? We have a show, a show and tell. And this piece of furniture um, needed a little bit of loving, as you can see, and this is the result. colors did we use? We used the Frenchic Furniture Paint color palette. So the drawers here are painted with the wall chalk paint which is called Bonbon. And here in between we have the Funky Dora. Uh, what the, the color up here and the Harlequin design that we did on the surface is Funky Dora and a mix of plum pudding with loof and then we had um, some browning wax after sending a little bit to age it a little uh, we used some browning wax uh, to give it um, more depth and on the sides we used the same colors basically the mix of plum pudding and loof uh, uh, funky dora and bonbon to do the three stripes on the side we also used the mix here on the knobs. Um, first we, we painted them in bonbon, then we did some gold with the gorgeous gold Frenchie, and afterwards we dry brushed with the mix of plum pudding and loof. And finally we did this uh, image transfer here. Um, these are all bits and pieces of an image transfer. Uh, I will show you soon the, the pieces and then afterwards we sealed everything with wax, with clear wax, so that everything can stay in place. The image transfers we have used for this piece of furniture are from IOD and you buy them like this, they are in sheets, every bit of it is uh, separate so you can do your own bouquet and as you can see, our bouquet um, ended up like this. We didn't want to create. Uh, excuse me. Uh, we didn't want to create a messy bit, so we used practically the same color as, or or similar to bonbon, uh, with some dark shadings here, and uh, finally. Uh, we mixed and matched to create this simple yet very effective bouquet of flowers. And finally I'm going to show you how to create the harlequin effect. Basically you need, uh, basically I used an A4 paper. These are certificates that will be used when we have uh, courses on how to do these things here. Um, and we started with this A4 sheet. We divide it into four.
we divide it into four, like this, and then we took the edges. to create the corner here. So once you have done all four corners, you should start looking something like this, then you cut all the four sides, right? And you have this here. Once you have this shape at hand, it's very simple. You just find the middle of the furniture or wherever you want the shape uh, to go, put the shape in place, mark with a pencil the edges like this, and then with a ruler or something that is very straight, you just go with the pencil like this. Then you cover the places where you want uh, to paint with masking tape. And then uh, what I did here was uh, I divided into two sets of shapes that I needed to paint. So basically I did first uh, four and then the second four um, shapes with the with our mix of color and then finally um, when everything was dry and ready we sent it a little bit to age a bit and afterwards we just used browning wax to create some effect like this here you liked this episode today was a little bit different than usual uh, and also I hope that you like this make over here and I hope you enjoyed seeing me on the floor messing and cleaning my workshop don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel see you next time Ta -ta.